I'm in Ghana. I just got out of Togo and I'm in Ghana. Hello lovely it's a girl if Kimura here you welcome back to my channel thank you so much for coming back always I appreciate you so so much but if this is the first time clicking on my video I appreciate you as well but please don't forget to subscribe and pin on your notification bell so you can enjoy more interesting content from here in today's video I'm going to take you through an adventure solo trip I on back from Nigeria to Ghana but before that in the beginning i embarked on this same journey from ghana to nigeria to explore these two countries that is nigeria and benin and this is how i'm returning from ghana through to benin togo then to ghana so let's get right into the video stay tuned and enjoy let's go guys so i'm saying goodbye to nigeria Abby. and thank you guys so much this is Uche. Uche is the see me of number one <laughs> The other friends <laughs> have seen me off already, they've gone to work, so which is home and uh, he is taking me to the bus station to Nigeria, Nigeria Benin border. Bye. I love to explore, see things for myself and experience new things. And in all, I'm always excited sharing my travel experience. So as I said in the beginning, I explored two countries in one trip, that is Nigeria and Benin. In this trip, I did a short shot like that is from one border to the other. I knew about the straight car from Ghana to Nigeria, but I wanted to do the short one to know how this is. I've traveled from Ghana to Benin before, but I've never crossed Benin to Nigeria before. So I decided to go by the short shot that is border to border road to Nigeria bet you it was very stressful even though it was stressful when going but when coming back also i decided to do the same border to border why because i've explored i first explored nigeria and i'm on my way to explore benin as well so from benin i'll go straight to ghana through togo and in all why i went on this short short trip which was very stressful was that it was less costly because I was on a tight budget. For all the stress, I'm excited I did this and I have something to share to my viewers. So they can base on my experience to decide anytime they want to do such a travel.
Okay, so I'm um, at Sebatabi runabout at the Canada Club to seven. So, okay, so we're going to Pukunobu. We're going to Beni Pukunobu. Continuing the trip, you're not going to Ghana now. So let's go, guys. From Badagri to Seme, the border is 1,000. The front will take two persons and the back will take four persons or six persons. Nigeria is crazy, like everything overloading. Actually, so I have to pay for two for the front if I want to take it alone. So, pay me two for front, so 2,000 naira. Seven cross brother, seven cross brother. From Nigeria, I was going to explore Beni and I had a list of places that I wanted to visit and Potonobo was part. Potonobo is also close to Nigeria Beni border, so that was my first stop. Crossing the border, I paid 1000 naira to exit Nigeria and 500 naira to enter Beni. And I had to go get a hotel to lodge, something to eat, rest, and then explore the following day. And with this one, I I got a stranger to help me out. the name of the lake? Pardon? Name, Panam. Yeah. Eh, lake. Potnubo. No, no, the water, the water, the, the water. name. Yeah. The water doesn't have this. Oh, okay. Yeah. show you around okay i'll show you the hotel just 16,000. it's affordable and nice as well so i'll give you a hotel tour okay if anytime you come to potonovo you can come here okay, so this is my hotel room in Be potonovo beni i will show you guys around tomorrow morning it's late the interesting part is that i got someone to help me from the border he drove me uh, it was a ride motor ride 
all the way to Cotonou. We helped me search for affordable hotel and I got this for just 16,000 Sefa. It's a very nice hotel. Just please, there's a nice view. A nice view. The bed is nicely laid. And that's you see, see the gate. See, see the room. Charlie. People, people are nice to me. Oh, like I don't know. I don't know him. So like, hey, I'm going to Portonova. I say I'm going to Portonova. Then I help you go. Look at this. It's a mirror actually. I thought it's a way. Okay, so this is my room. My soap. Actually, I have a soap bath, no problem. And the toilet and my bath. I have a towel. Oh gosh, that's so nice. So tomorrow morning I'm going to give you a hotel tour, okay? And give you a hotel tour. So we're leaving to Kotonu. I did one night in Potonovo and after exploring the following day, on that same day I left um uh, Potonovo to Kotonu. I have a video of exploring uh, Potonovo on my channel. You can kindly go back and check it out. So now I'm leaving Potonovo to Kotonu. Now let's continue our journey from Potonovo roundabout to Kotonu. And the rider I got from Potonovo Roundabout to Kotonu was so good. On that day, they were celebrating the Voodoo Festival. So he decided to take me through the town to see how these things are done. I also have a video of seeing this Voodoo thing on my channel. You can kindly go check it out. Come here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They are going to dance. Okay. I really enjoyed his ride. He was open, friendly, approachable, and also explaining all the things that we're seeing on the way, more like a tour guide to me.
padre. You see here is cotonou. Cotonou is expensive. Cotonou is not cotonou. Eh, sort of nonsense. But the one I slept in Porto Novo, oh, I love it. They gave me a room that cost 15,000. It's it's like 2% of the one I slept in Porto Novo. No problem, just one night. And then I moved to Rubitinko. Let's continue my journey. I'm done exiting Beni. And now, for entering Togo, so I'm going to go entering Togo, uh, exiting Beni and entering Togo. I'm going to pay 2,000 sifa for that for both countries. 2,000 sifa. Now, let's go exit Beni to Ghana. Go to point tomorrow, so I have to lodge the hotel closer. And I'm here at Gome, also in Beni, very close to the border. So that from the Google Timpo activity, I move straight through the border of Beni to Togo, then Togo to Ghana. You see, this hotel is good. I'm gonna do a video about it. So now I'm going to do registration. Most of the hotels, you give them your passport for registration. So after I'm going to show you my room and the environment. So if you want to come and do this activity at the Coco Timpon, this is the best place for you to lodge. It's very close. So that is the name of the hotel. Hotel Le Repo du Bura. <laughs> it's not that bad it's cool actually i'm gonna get ac 12,500 sifa hmm, my face is not giving yesterday i slept in one year year hotel in kotonu that's oh, right no even the fan is not even working properly nowhere come but i say 9,000 there 15,000 too is not nice. You see, this is Kotonu, 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 whatever. <laughs> but I slept in a very nice, beautiful hotel in Kotonu for just 16,000 sifa. It was lovely. You see that video? Twelve thousand five hundred. Super room. That's the best room. 
Oh, I have a towel. Oh, okay. Is it really reusable? Oh, I think they've been using this for a very long time. I'm gonna go find something that I'm not eating any better food since morning. Oh okay. god, they don't have Wi Fi. No Wi Fi till I get to Ghana tomorrow. So from now to tomorrow, I'm not coming online, okay? Anyway, let me go find something to eat and get some rest and prepare for tomorrow's activity. Hi, my last money. The only money left on me. 20,000 CFA. Like 40, sorry, like 400 for tomorrow's activity, then back to Ghana. Hey, have mercy, have mercy. Anyway, let's go find something to eat out of this. It will not end that. So, just at the roadside, and that's the hotel. Guys, can you imagine? I came and I came, they said no Wi Fi. After a while, they brought this Wi Fi, my personal Wi Fi. Personal Wi Fi, like the whole hotel. I'm having this to myself. They've given me password and then they've placed the thing in my room. Oh! Hey, hey, I'm not going to sleep. I'm not going to sleep. Update you guys. Update you guys. <laughs> Thank you. Girls. Guys, so finally, finally, we are done with all the activities. And I say thank you guys for staying tuned. And thank you, everybody. And thank you, everybody, for, I want to say thank, a big thanks to God for seeing me through all these travels, all new people, going to new places alone, and doing all activities alone, for seeing me through, keeping me safe. And now I'm going home. It's, uh, it's like with the last trip, the last journey. So guys, let's go. God, continue to be by my side. Let me go. And let me get home safely. Want to meet again? No, we are still going. We are not yet done. So let's go. Now I'm going from Kome to Hilakonji border. Uh, Beni border. Beni Togo border. Then cross and cross and cross. Then to Ghana. Let's go. Let's turn at the standby, the roadside, and pick a car going to Hilakonji. From here to Hilakonji, it's not that far. You get there soon, okay? Exit. I'm on my way to exit Beni. Yeah, then and Tato go. Let's go. I'm done exiting Beni and now I am putting the stamp for entering Togo. So I'm good to go. Entering Togo, uh, exiting Beni and entering Togo, I'm going to pay 2000 Sifa for that. For both countries, 2000 Sifa. Now let's go exit Beni to Ghana. So when I'm in Lomika, waiting for the other passengers to get food and move to the border. Yeah, right now, the time is 3.36. We're waiting for passengers. We're going to cross Togo. We're in Togo right now. So we're going to exit Togo then in Tagana. Border, Aneho. 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 
Benny is a Kalakoji. The great Aneho, that's it over there. Come on, come on. 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 Come Eh? It was 3.54 Now the time has changed to 2.54 It was 3.54 Right now I'm at the border. I'm going to exit Togo, then enter Ghana in no time. It's just ahead of me. That's nice Togo border, Togo Ghana. So let's go cross. Right now, hello guys. I'm in Ghana. I just got out of Togo and I'm in Ghana, done with immigration checks and everything. The car from uh, Togo Beni border took me 2000 to get to Togo border and I'm done exiting Togo I paid 2000 safer Ghana you're not going to pay anything I'm not I didn't pay anything because I'm a Ghanaian so right now I am good to go let me go find something to eat and get Kumasika so I just booked the ticket 555 as a VIP to Kumasi the car is yet it's already full there with two seats so i'm going to sit there so let me go and eat and come let me go and eat okay i'm going to eat i'm tired i'm sweating see how i'm sweating hey my first food in ghana after a long trip bounty 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 and then continue my journey from Akutawutu Kumasi. Hey, I'm very tired. Look at my face. I'm going to sleep. <laughs> so we go to Kumasi. <laughs> Not a small trip, I'm going to sleep. I might not even continue the video. Hi. Four o'clock at the time. Four o'clock. If you are not a market woman going to buy things from a flower or something, don't book Kumasi Street. Just a car and then Kumasi you go. Don't book Kumasi car. If I show you how they, they've loaded things, even at passenger area, even at passenger area, you'll be shocked. Hey, so we are going in at 10 p.m. We go to Kumasi tomorrow morning. So I'm going to go to Kumasi because I'm coming to sleep.
Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. It's 10 12 and I'm almost home. See, you Uber, uh, it's not even Uber, boat. I book you boat that I'm going home. Then I get to the location, he asked me, Where are you going? Like, you didn't know the location before accepting. Where are you going? He says, I'm going to go I'm going to go I'm going to go I'm going to go i just have my bags and the goose. So. And then they made you a man and see few a year coffee. I'm going to say some more. Master, can I be free? A flower. I buy in a city. Master, dead trap. Pow. Thank God. So I'm going to say. And you, if you are traveling from a flower and you are not a market woman and I say market man, I'll go find you a flower. Don't take the commercial straight guy. The VIP, especially the VIP. And yeah, 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 it's not good. It they will pack things like they are more concerned about the loads than the people. They don't care about the people. They are more concerned. They pack things even in the walkway. You are packing your man. I say if you are traveling, one can find your more flower. Please don't use the VIP that goes to Kumase from a flower. Don't. This is a lesson. And I've experienced it myself. Then try a crowd. Yeah, oh Charlie. You book your car around four. Yeah, two not ten PM. Me me book no catch me that can put two. Yeah. Thank God I'm home. Thank God I'm home. And thank you guys for staying tuned to watch to the end. We me quota. Me quota. I to watch me. Kodi. Me di ya then. I will sleep. Until meet again in my next video. It's a girl with your camera. I love you. And bye bye.